Okay, pretty yeah, well. this is the last thing I really give a shit about asking you about. What? Why are you currently beefing with Big Phase, a.k.a. the game's older brother? First and foremost, I cannot beef with Big Phase because that is game's brother. Out of pure respect of game, that could never happen. Second of all, what I'm doing with game would never uh, uh, tell me I can't do is I'm simply defending myself. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm reading that he says that I stole his label. Jeez. Now, the only label I've known him to be a part of is Black Wall Street. Mm-hmm. Right? My label was 100 Entertainment. Right now, can I steal No Jumper? Right now. It's copyrighted. It would be difficult. I can't do it, right? Because you already own it. Trademarked, whatever. So, I use if I, listen, this is a, and all you motherfuckers in the ghetto, wherever y'all at, need to understand this. Just because you talking about some shit in your living room and in your front yard or your backyard with your pet bull and your beat-up-ass weight set, just because you're talking about something you want to do and somebody else is thinking about something they want to do and they go through the necessary steps, contacting their trademark attorneys and shit like that, track and see if it's available, the dot-com. I had to spend like five grand for the dot-com because somebody had it. It wasn't him, right? The trademark was available. Bro, say great minds think alike. But motherfucker, don't say I took something from you that I never knew that, well, you never had. Because if you'd have had it, I would have been able to, to buy it and secure it. Mm-hmm. And that we never talked about. All I know you to be a part of is Black Wall Street. That's it. I, I don't know him to have had a label. And even that label wasn't his. You understand what I'm saying? It wasn't his, so... I don't know. You got to remember, like, I don't really know him. By the time I came in Games World, he wasn't there. Uh-huh. It had been like three, four years that whatever happened with them happened. But your big gotcha was to say, like, look at this text in which he was asking for because money Because he some kept point, right? calling me a nobody. Mm. He puts up the 100 video, okay? I'm the label on the video. All those dudes in that picture are from the same neighborhood. For me to step in that picture... It's like it's like you taking a family picture and I go put get in the motherfucker. Like, bro, that's fucking a family picture. Let them take their picture. Mm. But nevertheless, that video shoot, okay, the, the financing of the video shoot and all the, the business around the video shoot, that's my end of it, right? Game uh, produced the song, put the feature on there, and and dictated where the fuck he wanted to shoot the video. I got to facilitate the budget what it costs, so on and so forth. Clearing the motherfucking video. I had to clear that shit with Birdman. Mm -hmm. All that shit, right, for it to come out. So, you know, him saying, well, you're on the other side of the camera because I'm on the side of business. Now it's an oxymoron in that. I think that's the real problem, is that I am on the other side of the camera of business, right? This is something I earned. Game just didn't fucking let me in. Prior to me, he went through shit with other people, right? What year did you start working with Game? 2010, 2011. Mm. Their shit split was like 06, 07. He came out in like 2004? Four or five. Mm. I believe him and his brother split was 06, 07. By the time I came around Game, no big face was in the picture. Him and his brother aren't in communication still? I don't know. Mm. That's his brother. And I know that's his brother. In regards to what he says, like it's a whole lot of shit I could have did fucked up. Mm-hmm. But out of respect the game, right? I can't do these things. Two T's from Bounty Hunters is the one that made it possible for me to come talk to game. After I did something for game, he talks about it in a song. Let me tell you how I met my nigga Wack. We wasn't always through the good. When I met him, he was rolling with Shug. A real situation happened that day. And I shook his hand and walked away. A couple months later, I started managing this guy named Stacy Adams and I needed a feature so I reached out to T's was head of security which is now works for TDE he used to be head of security for Kendrick now he's head of security for SZA and he made it happen right so when I came over there there was no big face I don't know why it's not my fucking business right um he mentioned uh why didn't you push uh last circle or whatever those are games entities of business, right? I work for those. I don't own those. Mm. So quite naturally, the thing that I'm doing business for myself will be under my entity of business. 
Winter Circle and, and shit like that. Those are games entities of business. So I don't know like what he's on, but if you're telling me that uh, shit with Drake was 2015. Mm. So if I'm nobody, then why in 2017 you reaching to me? Now the things he was asking me for, I couldn't do. Why? Because that's the disloyal shit you was doing. Mm -hmm. If you got some issues with your brother, I work for your brother. You think he's putting it on you because it's more convenient? No, I, I'm put, I work for your brother. I'm with your brother. So you can't reach to me because you can't reach to him for whatever reason. Mm -hmm. So for me to do that for you, I will be undermining game. Mm -hmm. It's not going to happen. My loyalty, my dedication, all that shit is to game, not you. Now, if game tells me as he's done, whack, go take my brother this money, drop it off. He had a fucking... 96 Impala, he had redid, put about 50, 60 grand in it. He said, whack, I ain't driving the motherfucker. Go drop this off with my brother. He could have it. I dropped it off, right? We went and filmed something over there. He said, whack, make sure my brother can make some money on it. I make sure he makes some money on it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, my dealings with him is just through game. I had no personal dealings, but you tried to make it personal and go behind game's back and try to contact me to get me to do shit for you. And I think he got mad because I wouldn't do it. I kept it real, bro. Like, I don't, my only interaction with you is when game tells me to interact with you. Mm. This ain't no paru shit, okay? This is business. And my dedication and my loyalty, don't get it fucked up. It's to game when it comes to that situation. So I think he attacks me. Somebody just told me out there. He's jealous of y'all relationship. Hey, bro, me and game get into it all the time. But you know the difference? I don't go to fucking social media and attack him. Mm. I don't go to social media and say, you ain't this and you ain't that. Social because, media these days is like the last resort for somebody if you who let, can't get If you let somebody, Big right? Face have it his way, let's talk about it. If you let Big Face have it his way, he tried to destroy game. Your own flesh and blood, your own brother. When he tried to bring somebody over there to the block and say, yeah, game, if you're this and that, why is this dude on the block? Where you at? And game responded by, you know, certain people ain't going to speak on that and he'll, he'll rest in peace by sending a homie over there and knocking Big Face out and, and you know, taking the jury from him. This where I'm at. If Big Face could have got away with that, that shit would have fucked game's credibility up in the streets back when the street shit meant something. Because the G-Unit movement beef was going on and all that. So, you know, don't tell me about who that man's supposed to be to you because you're the very same man that tried to kill that man off. Do not reach out to me to do anything for you that the game himself says he's not doing. I'm with the game. You are his brother. If game tells me in a heat of an argument today, whack, send big face a hundred thousand. I'm going to send big face a hundred thousand because game act told me to do so. Mm -hmm. That's it. Like, bro, don't put me in the middle of your shit. I wasn't around when y'all fell out. I don't know nothing about no hundred entertainment. I researched. Can you research? I don't see nothing that ties big face to a hundred entertainment previously. None of that shit. I've never heard this dude rap. I just know him for being Gaines brother and part of Black Wall Street. Mm -hmm. And from my understanding, a guy named G-Ride was really one of the main characters in creating Black Wall Street. I could be wrong, but I think he owned like the dot com and shit like that, was part of the creative side of it. Other than that, I don't know too much about him, bro. And I think he's mad because of our continued uh, success, our continued business. Me and Game get into a bump heads argue, fuss, fight, knows and knows all that the world will never know about it because we deal with that shit as brothers and as businessmen. Mm. And I don't give a fuck whatever happened. You'll never hear me speak or utter a disrespectful word, a degrading word about game or any of my motherfucking clients, whatever happened. It ain't going to happen. But And I'm just a guy. You guys share the same DNA. Mm -hmm. And you attacked this man, tried to make this man look like he wasn't who he was and destroy his career. Jealousy, envy, and greed. I'm not that guy. If you're mad at me for my actions towards you that represents my loyalty for game, then motherfucker be mad. If I got to pick and choose who I want mad at me, big face of game.